Hello everyone, Sentinel Blaster, and welcome to episode number 25 of our Pokemon Sun Let's Play here on the channel. In the last episode, you guys, we finally met the big bad boss man of Team Skull himself, your boy Guzma. And he kind of blew us the fuck back with his Golisopod, but then we, uh, we came back from that, and then we, um, he, uh, quickly gave us the Incinium Z for our Incineroar. And then we had an evolution, so definitely make sure to check out that last, uh, last episode, if you're not already, but today, I'm not really sure what we're going to be doing, I guess we're going to be heading towards our, our sixth trial? We could probably a ghost sixth trial? I don't know. Anyways, if you guys are hyped for some more sun, make sure you smash the like below for us, because you're all ready. No, your support is greatly appreciated with that, let's go quick party re-clap. Re-clap. <laughs> First off, we have Buzzkill, level 37, our hate nature Chocobo, who likes to fight. On the Electrum Z, Rock and Spark, Exocer Dig, and Crunch. Then you have Zero, level 37, our Timid Naked Wishy Wash, who's highly curious. On the Water, you have Z, Rock and Skull, Fantac, Hidden Power, Poison, and Aqua Ring. Then we have Paint, level 38, our Mild Naked Alolan Muck, who was the one that evolved in the last episode, who still has an awesome thought on the lefties, because he's still hungry. Rocking Poison Fang, Knockoff, Minimize, and Crunch. Then we have Diamond, level 37, our Gentle Naked Lycan Rock, who's quick to flee. Holding the Rock, you have Z, Rock and Rock Slide, Brick Break, Bite, and Accelerate Rock. We have my precious. Level 38, our Adamant Natured Lorantis, who loves to eat. On the grass, we have the Rock and Leaf Blade, Leech Life, Pebble Blizzard, and Swords Dance. And then we have Rufus, level 38, our Dawson Naked Incineroar, who's somewhat stubborn. On the Incinium Z, Rock and Darkest Lariat, Fire Fang, Bulk Up, and Shadow Claw. So, you guys, we're starting back here because I, be I did go ahead and battle all the trainers on this radar screen. So we can go ahead and talk to this guy. And, yes, Z-Power. Yeah, I battled some of these guys off-screen, but I feel like I should... I feel like I should battle at least one of these guys on-screen, so we're here. And we're going to go ahead and battle... Collector Andrew. Collector Andrew, who has a Ladian. Okay, I don't think this is why he's going to be using a Z-Power on. He's going to be using on a second Pokemon, most likely. I like how... I, like, I, I, I haven't done this at all since we got a Charge Bug, but I like how every time you send out Charge Bug, he, like, scoots back a little bit. I'm just going to go for the Spark Reflect. Oh, come on. Come on, my dude. That's, that, that Spark's going to do nothing. JK sold... Oh, that's a crit. I was going to say. Buzzkill isn't that good. I mean, I love the fuck out of Buzzkill, but Buzzkill, admittedly, is not that good. Like, isn't that... Isn't good enough to, like, Oko... Oh, wow. You have, I chose the right, the right guy to start, start us out with. You have a Bug-type Z-Move that's waiting for us. Alright, um... Let's go ahead and go into... You know, let's go into Rufus, and let's unleash our own Z-move on you. Go on, Rufus, I know you can do it. Yeah, I've been using Pokemon Refresh a lot. It's like Pokemon Me 2.0, to be honest, I like it. Alright, let's go ahead and fire up that Z-Power, Malicious Moonsault. Who's going first? Oh, we're going first. Yo, I love how, like, Incineroar just comes down and says, like, look, look, look at him, look at him, he's just so confident, and just, oh my god, I love him. He's cool. He's cool. I know a lot of people don't like it, but I do. It's malicious moonsault. Do 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 do. Let me stop. I just pushed the cat scene and even further. Sword dance. Oh gosh, golly, oh gosh darn. You better use your Z move now. Let's go for that fire fang. Jk, we don't get, we, we don't give you, we don't get, we ain't gonna give you the chance. Which is kind of unfortunate, really, because I kind of wanted to see the bug type Z move, but oh well. I'm sure at, at some point we'll get the buggy MZ and then we'll give it to our charger bug and or hopefully we'll be a Vic Volt by then, but I don't know. Let's see. I, I know you can't get Vic Volt to the fourth island. Psych up, bro. Do you think I give a care about psych up? My dude. Alright, Mudsdale Gallop. Let's go ahead and run across here. Let's go ahead and navigate through the grass. Cause we ain't got time for no grass. Run past these dudes. Oh, we get okay. And you want to spare repel then? A repel because I do not want to be encountering wild Pokemon after wild Pokemon after wild Pokemon. There are super repels. I think I knew they were pretty far in. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and uh, try to get charged up to level 40, and then uh, we're gonna train someone else up. I feel like that's our best plan of action. Yeah, that 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 that, that scientist is actually a pretty dope team. You had a Porygon. 
And, um, what else did he have? He had something else that I can't remember. Oh, yeah, he had a magneton, I think. What is down here, though? Secluded shore? And there's someone here waiting for us. Alright, then. Swimmer, they're probably gonna have water types then, which is gonna be no problem for us. Swimmer Sarah. Okay, Swimmer Sarah, what you got? Okay, let me stop. See, look, look, watch, watch, watch. Scooty, scoot. Scoot, scoot, scoot. I love, I love Charger Bug. Right, let's go ahead and go for that Z Power because I don't know if a regular spark would be enough to finish. Seal it up. Oh. That's bullshit. So we're gonna have the whole animation for nothing. That's bullshit. Really, you're even gonna go through with the animation? Does it go through protect? Does it actually go through protect? It does? Bro? Can fully protect itself. Oh, so it gets the, does, it get no, does it just reduce the damage? Interesting. You learn something new every day. Yeah, we are totally overleveled. In case you're wondering why we're getting boosted experience, I'm pretty sure it's because like, a lot of our Pokemon are at least like three hearts on Pokemon Refresh, so... I can't have to stay on Mudsdale, fuck the bullshit. Another Zygarde thingy, another Ziggard. Uh, oh, there's berries. A cherry berry. What else we got? Another cherry berry. Look at all the slowpoke, though. And a chesto berry. Not bad. It's not a slowpoke, what do they want? No. Okay. Do you know why there are all these slowpoke here? In fact, we can't catch. Okay. Is this like Slowpoke Beach or something? Like what the hell? Oh, this guy wants a battle? Alright, bring it on, bitch. Welcome to Secret Beach. The Secret Beach? Is this actually a Secret Beach? Or is it just a regular old beach? Yo, this guy. <laughs> Swimmer Robert. He's flexing. FLEX! He's a Whiskash. Aw, oh, come on. That means I can't use my fucking electric type. It's okay though, it's okay, it's okay. You wanna know why it's okay? Because we have a po we, have a, we have the perfect Pokemon to deal with Whiskash. Come on out. My precious. Yo, look at Laurent. I love how the ball sparkles. I mean, I know that's because we got, you got her on a luxury ball. Okay, I did that on purpose, by the way. I did that because I wanted her to, like, love me. <laughs> Take that out of context real quick. <laughs> I, I did that because I wanted her to love me. Let's go for Petal Blizzard. We should just annihilate you. No Z move required. That's what I know you can do. I love how that happens. I love that. I love that. I love Laurentis. Look at Laurentis. Sandy Gast? Oh, this thing. Well, you about to get your ass whooped. You about to get your ass whooped. I was actually considering using this thing on the team, but I found it actually evolves pretty late, but apparently you can't find it until late in the game either, because I haven't found a single goddamn one so far. <laughs> He's annihilated it. That's it. I knew you could do it. Oh my. That fainting animation. Yo, 10 out of 10 best fainting animation. A oh, sun and moon, that's it. I don't care. I don't care anymore. <laughs> best fainting animation ever. Anyways, uh, is there anything over here? I feel like there's gotta be something over here. Alright, uh, I don't think there's much of pasta water, because I'm looking at the bottom screen and I can just see a bunch of rocks. So I can, I can just go surf exploring on that off screen, if I need to, because there's a little bit of space. Anyways, what is over here? Is this where we need to go? Route 13. Oh, something's going down. Dickno! And the new from Sophocles! You helped me out from testing the kind, yeah? The totem calling machine or whatever? I guess I was test subject number two, but I managed to get through the trial. Maybe I managed to get stronger, eh? You gonna battle me? Oh, you want me to take this? A max potion, okay. Well, that's a grin. Oh shit. You only have one volume, don't you? Haven't you ever heard the expression that silence is golden? Okay, he's back! Listen, Team Skull's looking for a Pokemon called Cosmog. Did you know anything? What? Not that we tell you. So you do know something. Look, Cosmog isn't even a strong Pokemon. Yeah, it only gets Splash and Teleport. It has the potential to summon Pokemon so terrifying and strong you don't even know. If something like that happened, it would be a disaster for Alola. A disaster like a real disaster, and what are we supposed to do about it? Protect it. If you do know what Cosmog is, or if you do find anything out, just keep it safe. I know I might, I know, I know I might be working with Team Skull right now, so you may not trust me or, quite, or care, but I can tell you this just once. You have to protect Cosmo no matter what. Well, Lily's already doing that, so... And I see a Mudsdale up there. Do you guys see that Mudsdale? I still don't even understand about how, how Team Skull found out about Cosmog in the first place. 
What do you mean? No matter what, you're gonna, you're gonna leave us hanging? Yes, he is. How? You got a problem with that? Dick, no. If you're really for, for looking for Cosmo, then is Lily gonna be okay? I don't, I don't really get what's going on, but we just gotta keep both of them safe, right? And I know what I'm gonna do. Take on my next dress, I can get even stronger. And give me my island challenge, and I can get, get, get the, 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 to recognize my strengths. Then I can be the next island kahuna. Yo, how's a kahuna be pretty fucking lo lit? I was trying to say lit and dope at the same time, lope. I wanna make sure and more, more and more people can have fun battling, see wins or loses. Ten of us both try to become real champions. Hey, what if How becomes a champion? That would like literally be a throwback to Gen 1 all over again. I wasn't here though. So there's waiting to change forever? What is that Pokemon? I would like to see what that Pokemon is. Come here, Pokemon. It is a odd oh, stuff. Aw. Phew. That's cute. That's, that's sad though. It's been waiting for a trainer. So basically, their stuff was trainer kind of just. Oh, there's a mosey. What's up? Yo. Twinsies. <laughs> okay. Yo, guys, is a Ziggard thing though? A Ziggard thing though? A strange creature. It's a Ziggard. Well, it's not a Ziggard, but it's a Ziggard cell core thing. Found a moonstone, okay. So he had a Clefairy. Clefairy! He'd be able to evolve that. Oh. We're just finding Zygarde things left and right. Giggity goddamn. What's down here, though? Do you battle? What do you do? You walk, you're gonna fix up. Okay. Good for you. Buddy. Buddy. Found a guard spec? Boy, I, I don't give a goddamn about no guard spec. Guard spec. Yo, let's trailer park, though. Nah, I don't think we're gonna need one. I feel like someone's either bringing us up a- Okay. Oh, there's an Oranguru over here. Yo, let's talk to this Oranguru. <laughs> You're walking that guy? Being a creep? Yeah, what? Oh. So we can't go through there. So, where are we supposed to go? I haven't seen a single lick of thing that tells us where we're supposed to go. Do we go back over this way? What's... Oh, no, this has to do with the, the Mudsdale. So we don't go this way. Oh, hold on, I see a little path down here. Hold on. Hold on a second. Yo, it's Team Skull, dude. We got a problem with short stuff. I can scan. I can stand guarding when I'm squatting. Yo, wait, does that mean Team Skull's in here? Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Yo, Team Skull's in here. Team Skull is born out of this old group that once formed around one of the old kahunas. The whole thing fell apart after they got smacked down by the wrath of the Tapu. So this person is literally just letting a Team Skull go and stay here? Bro? What's in here? Kinda doing a little bit more exploratizing. Because, you know, why not? Oh, punk. Punk dude. Did someone say you can come in here? Yeah, let's fight. Fuck the bullshit. Oh my god. Really? Taunt? So you can pussy out anyways? Alright. The Ruins of Abundance? Throw it down, out. Brock! Just shot to Brock. Now let's hop back on our Moodsdale. Let's go ahead and head on over. Down this way, because I guess this is where our Ghost Trail is. Tapu Village. Ooh. Kind of feckin' lit. Yo, how? You look, Dak, now it seems like we're almost to the Aether House, like the captain is supposed to be, huh? The Aether House? Okay. Hey, look, construction workers, that must be a cuckoo you're talking about. So they're really making a Pokemon League on top of Mount Lanakila. If I show me the Pokemon League, another week, like four crazy dawn trainers and then the, they call the Elite Four. The Elite Four are our, our, our island kahuna, the one who will come there stronger. I can't wait to find out. Yo, I know I said this before in a previous episode, but what if the uh, the uh, Kahunas end up being the Elite Four? That would be feckin' dope. Oh, so... Is this where the Pokemon League is gonna be? Bro? Let's go in here and heal up. Yo, know, I like riding on Mudsdale, though. It's kinda cool. Kinda cool. Let's go and heal up our Pekimans. Our Pekimans. Yo, look at Muck, though. Look at Muck, though. Can't wait, because we can actually, we're actually going to be able to get to use, actually, I'm kind of going to see what they sell here. We're actually going to be able to get to use Muck once we, um, because he's part Dark-type, so we're going to be able to use him in the, uh, the upcoming trial. Trial. 
Because we use uh, Rufus, we already used Rufus in like three trials so far, so we have 25 health potions. Okay, I might still have a couple more revives. Let's go like, like, no, that's too much money. Let's get like three more, I guess. Still a feck ton of money. Let's get a couple of these too. Let's get five. There we go. Uh, do we need super pals? Um, I think we're pretty good on super ruffles. Super ruffles. Anyway, let's go ahead and hop back on our Muds D Dale. And, um, hop on over here, because I'm looking at the bomb screen. And it is telling me that down here, at around here, is where we are supposed to go. There's a little flag. Oh, we're supposed to go that way? Okay, so that's the Aether House. Oh, those but Yo, dude, battle me. Battle me. Lola. He's not even sure of himself. Alright, it's gonna be one of those. <laughs> the Ace Trainers in the game also, honestly look badass. Alright, we got, boy. Sanctuary. Wait! You got an Alolan Sanctuary, though! Not even bad. So you're Ice Steel, right? I think you're Ice Steel. Which means that, um. You know, I should go for Exeter. Let's not go for any, like, super effective moves. I should go for straight up for the Exeter. Oh, right, you're steel. Welp. <laughs> I forgot that. Rip me, right? I've already done enough stupid things in this game already, so... It just adds to less. Let's go for Dig. Bro, it's way under the ground. He's Iron Head? Bro, you have Iron Head. That is wild. So are you gonna have an Alolan Vulpix 2, or what? Are you gonna have an Alolan Vulpix 2, or what? Or are you gonna have a Sand Slack? No, you're gonna have a Marowak. An Alolan Marowak. You know, I think, actually, yeah, you know, I think this is a good enough time as any to go ahead and test out our new Alolan Muck. Yo, look at me. Look at this thing. I like how it changes color. That's probably, like, one of the main reasons why I love it so much. Alright, let's go for that crunch. Eh. Yo, get obliterated, Marowak. Get obliterated. Paint is here. Paint is here, my dudes. My dudes. Anyways, let's go ahead and head on over to the Aether House and see what is moving and shaking over here. Because apparently something's going on over here. Oh shit, there's an Oranguru. So there was a purple haired lady. <laughs> no, it's just an Oranguru. Wait up, Dick. Now it's the Aether House, eh? Strangers. And a young goose. This means battle. What? Why? We're better home when the Aether roll is away. So wait, is Aether Roll a part of Team Aether? Because why else would she be at the Aether House? Are these guys seriously gonna have a fucking young goose? Elekid. Interesting. Interesting. Well, Elekid's about to get his fucking ass whooped. Because Buzzkill is here. Alright, let's go ahead and go for that X Kizzer. Electro Ball? We resist that, my dude. We're gonna eat that up. That does no damage. And we're hasty, so we're. A plus speed nature. <laughs> and well, Exeter just obliterates you. To be a preschooler hunter. I tried to rehide I'm a kid, you know. You didn't slide one, yeah, then why's this little fellow still gnawing on me? Damn, leave him alone, young goose. No one likes you. Hi back, everybody! I look like I finished up a shopping spree right on time! Fuck it, everyone! God, that voice. <laughs> that voice is fun to do, but also annoying at the same time. Oh, yeah, we met all right in battle anyway, but hey, where's Lily? Left her with Hapu. She should be, she should be coming soon. So why don't we get those trials done first? You know, the captain, right? Yeah, actually, you, do, you do look like a ghost type person. Okay, so wait, what do we do? Do we just talk to you? The band inside where the supermarket used to be. I'll wait in wait front of the Aether house to show you the way if you'd like. So do you think just leave? Or what? Oh, we do. Where do you think you're going? Stop it. Stop it right now. For real, girl, your bag was moving right in front of my eyes. And I think I'm supposed to ignore that. If you got some red Pokemon in there, I'm going to have to take and make some chaos. And if it's not that rare Pokemon, I bet I can still get paid, yo. Techno. Oh, we're following that script, huh, are we? I turned back forward to save the girl, huh? I'm not going to let you be the hero in this case. Yeah, we are going to protect Cosmog at all friggin' costs. And Lily too, but eh. <laughs> right, come here. Bring that ass here, boy. What you got? What you got? Oh, this is the same fucking dude. 
betting you $20. I'm betting real money, $20. That this guy is the same guy that we've been battling this whole time. Was fucking drowsy. Dig? That's what you were alerted to? My dude. My dude. You weren't alerted to this ass whooping. Bitch. Get the fuck out, my dude. Get the fuck out, my dude. I swear that's the same dude. When I saw that adorable drowsy, it was that was enough for me later. But I'm gonna turn around and come back and be like, hey. Phew, thank you, Techno. I just wanna go for a stroll on my own, see what see what it must feel like to be a trainer. So how and I went our own separate ways. And then I tried to get out of my bag. Didn't you go on you little trouble maker? You better thank Techno too. Pew. Oh and um when I was shopping, I kept thinking about how I wanted to be some help to you during your rounds and I saw these. Luxury. I was just talking about luxury balls and how we caught pressure from them. I bought them without even thinking. Well, alright then. Oh boy. Oh, yee -hee. It's the matter, you look all worn out! You are sitting there out the while! Oh, hey, Cirilla, thank you. I think I might have to take you up on that. You did know! We can reach my trial server, Dapu Village! Come on, follow me! Alright then. Oh, what is Rome saying? Okay, okay, the next trial side is creeping me out a bit. You sure we need to go in there? We absolutely need to fucking go in there. So we have to go all the way back to Tapu Village for this giggly goddamn trial. Okay. Okay, I see how it is. I see how it is. Yo, what kind of Pokemon can we find here? I just kind of want to see. What kind of can we find anything interesting? Anything of value? A rat and a Lolan Radicate, alright. Stupendous. <laughs> scoop scoop. Yeah, I'm just gonna blow that I'm just gonna blow you the fuck back. Don't mind me. Don't mind me, I'm gonna blow you the fuck back. Alright, so that's cool, that is cool. I'm just gonna head on back to Tapu Village. I'm just going to heal up. I'm going to you're up late. It's only 8.28 p.m. EST, EST, breaking the fourth wall, I know. Thank you for waiting, wish you were wonderful health, I'll see you again, yada yada yada. Anyways, uh, let's go ahead and hop back on our Moodsdale. And I think we're going to go ahead and head back to Tapu Village. And then end off the episode. Actually, this is Tapu Village, what the hell? So is this the trial site, right here? Nope, that's the Pokemon League. I forgot about that. It, so I guess I try to say it this way. So we can reach it through Tapu Village. Didn't you see? So we can go through back to this trailer park. I see a pro pass, okay. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Alright, so I, wait, wait, I think, because I saw a little thing up here. So I bet that is where we're supposed to go for a trial. So I think we're going to go ahead and wrap up this episode right here. Next episode, we will begin our sixth trial of the game. So get hyped for that. But if you guys enjoyed this episode, send your hype for more. Make sure you smash the like button below for us. You already know. Your support is greatly appreciated. But with that, I'm going to get a boat. Thank you guys for watching this video. But we out this bitch. Bye.